What's up guys, welcome back. Today we're at Hilton in Tumon, Guam. We're gonna go give you this cool uh, Islander Terrace uh, buffet that they have here on Saturdays. It's a pretty one, it's a pretty good one that I do love. We're gonna go ahead and head down there and we'll get some grub, I'll show you how it is. And let's go check it out. Islander Terrace here at the Hilton, Guam, Tumon. They also have this Sunday brunch buffet that you could come check out on Sundays. I'm not sure there's no price, but they have carving stations, which is the inside of, of the thing, as you can see over there. Pretty cool. It's just below near the pool side, which is the Hilton Tree Bar. Right over here is the Islander Terrace. I'll show you the, the fee or the menu. All right. We're at the Islander Terrace. Today's uh, Saturday, so it's the 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. This is their price for the Saturdays. The adults are 40. Kids uh, four and below are free. 20 bucks for kids. And if you're here on Friday, it's actually cheaper, 35 for adults. And for kids uh, five and below, or four and below, 17.50. This is considered their lunch buffet pleasures. Delight in international cuisines at the Allender Terrace restaurant here in Hilton. Let's go check it out. I think over here is their grilling station and they have like some carving stations right over here on Sundays. Uh, I think every day is a different day when they do their, their like buffets here at the Islander Terrace. I like this little pizza stuff. This is how it looks inside. We'll go ahead and start showing you the foods. Not bad, they also have some corn. Our plates are looking good. They even have a ramen noodle station. Chicken kalbi, something I don't really see. Chicken kalbi. We got a whole black mussels with ginger sauce. Fried fish with tartar sauce. We're waiting for that one. So they got soy broth for the ramen that you saw earlier and they have this chicken arascaldo which is kind of like rice porridge and they have fried fish with tartar sauce. This one is the whole black mussels with ginger sauce and then they have chicken kalbi which is pretty interesting. I've never heard of chicken kalbi. Maybe just like chicken and then call that the garlic shrimp. It's in there. I know you can't see it but it's in there. The shrimps are in there. You could also get this bread and put it in this oven and then yeah cool all right so this is the desserts they have brownies taro cheesecake which looks really good they also have the coconut tapioca that one looks interesting it's something i do want to try we'll try that later and uh chocolate almond orange mousse oh we also got pink velvet cake Yes, there's strawberries on them. Pecan pie. Double chocolate cake. We got nachos and taco station. You can make your own tacos. Pretty good looking. That's the meat, I guess. Oh, you even have a hot dog station. You can make your own hot dog. Pretty cool, man. You can make a chili dog and more. We'll go ahead and show you more. Also, they have this soba. I'm not so sure what this is. Soba. It looks like soba. Japanese soba. And a weird, uh, not weird, but shave iced for halo halo. Cool. That's cool. This, this cool dessert aisle. Also, as well as I showed you the fruits. There's uh, fruits and then also uh, blended fruit drinks. You got orange juice. You got calamansi juice. I kind of want one. Mango juice infused water. And of course, you got a cool ice cream station. Oh, here. You also got some sushis. Onigiris and rolls. rolls and the salad area that they have here looking really good 
There's some different sauces and sides. Kimchi and more. This is their ice cream station with chocolate soft serve. You got vanilla, you got strawberry. You got these little cool stuff over here. Wow. <laughs> Made myself a cool taco over here at the taco station. This uh, Talia de Gallo kind of has uh, pineapples and there's a very chunky avocado or guacamole over there. You got more of this. That's a good looking taco already. So this is my plate at the moment. We'll go back and get more later. Uh, we got the pansy, we got the lechon, we got red rice, we got kalbi, and we got this buttered corn. As well as some soups and all this other stuff I'll show you. Let's go ahead and eat this bad boy. Alright, we'll go ahead and eat this. First stuff I want to try is actually the kalbi. It's a little bit, um, what do you call this, more uh, tendery, but it looks like they kind of like broiled or baked it before they actually like fried it or like grilled it. It doesn't really look like fried or anything, but it's like grilled. The nice touch has those little, uh, what's this called, uh, cucumbers, onions, and uh, cherry tomatoes. Which, uh, I, like, I love cherry tomatoes. Mm. We'll go ahead and <laughs> try this buttered corn. Oh man. That was really soaked with the juices of uh, the buttery corn. We're gonna go ahead and also try the pan soup. Mm. Mm. It has the regular thick noodles as well as the skinnier one, the pan soup. That's some good stuff. And it also tastes like very traditional Filipino pan stick. This big boy right here. Big lechon kawale slice. Ooh. Very fat. Mm. Oh. Wow. Very juicy and moist on the inside. The fat and the crunch, you saw it like just fall apart. Very uh, toasted rice. Oh, we got noodles and rice, Mikhail. Yeah. I'm really enjoying the pancit and shrimp. Mm. Mikhail likes the noodles here. I'm gonna go ahead and try that shrimp and uh, I'm not really sure if I'm gonna try the black mussels. All right, just gonna make me try this uh, garlic. Garlic. Spicy, very, it's a very good cook. Garlic shrimp. Oh man, good. Woo. But again, there's so much food. I gotta save some space to go get uh, some dessert. I guess I live in a birthday celebration. I didn't get the bun, but I just got a hot dog. <laughs> Tastes like a hot dog. This one. Pretty loaded soft taco. Look at that. Mm. I want to try their ramen that they have. It looks like a soyu. Mm. Really good broth. The noodles are Japanese style ramen noodles. Mm. Look at that. Mikhail got the ice cream. And got some cool uh, ebi, which is shrimp, sushi, wasabi, some cool macaroni salad. Can I try it? All right, now I'm gonna try the fish with tartar sauce. 
Again, there's so much to choose from here, and it's a good buffet. Mm, wow. <laughs> I think they make that. That tartar sauce in house as well. Really yummy. Mm. And I think the fish that they use is like cod. I'm not so sure. Also got me a calamansi drink. There's all types of juices over there, but I'm very overwhelmed with all the cool food that you can get here. And I have to check out this buffet. Woo. I do recommend it. Saturdays here at uh, the Islander Terrace here at Hilton. Ice cream. Of course, it is a buffet. You can get as much as you want, all you can eat. Um, my recommendation is actually get a little bit and try everything. I'm not gonna film everything that I eat here, but uh, the recommendation is to try some small piece of everything. So you get to try everything here, find what you like, and you know, have a blast eating here at the Islander Terrace at Hilton Hotel. Miguel's enjoying his ice cream. Maybe I'll get some too. All right, so you saw me stuffing my face and what I chose to eat. So I got those breads that you could uh, toast. I put the, there's a lot of like top, uh, what's that called? Things you could put inside. I put cream cheese. It's really hot, it's toasted, it's cracking. You can see that? And uh, it tastes really good. Mm. All right, Jen, she got hollow hollow. Ice cream. With ice cream. There's no ube and there's no like uh, electric fan, but. There's it's good. There's the electric plan. Uh, electric plan. On the hollow and the electric plan. And the lanka. And the lanka. Alright. So, like I said, this caught my eye earlier. It's coconut and tapioca. Looks really good. I'm gonna go ahead and take one and have a bite of this coconut tapioca dessert. All right, coconut tapioca. I'm not sure what is in this or what's or you know what how it's made. Of course, it looks like coconut tapioca. We'll mix that up. A little bite of this. Wow. If you're a coconut fan, you're gonna love this. I think that's also coconut milk. I'm not sure. Mm. Yeah. I recommend this right away here at the Islander Terrace. Mm. I'm gonna do the artist right now. Mm. Again, <clears throat> went back for round two and round three for this coconut tapioca. It has become one of my favorite desserts here. I'm gonna go ahead and devour this. I don't think you need to see that. This place also has some outside seating if it gets really full. Again, I came pretty late for their buffet. But yeah, you could sit out here and you could chow. All right, guys. So that was the Island of Terrace here in Hilton, Guam. I can't stress how uh, so much, I've eaten so much and I'm pretty fat, but uh, I'm pretty stoked. Delicious food here at the Island of Terrace, Hilton, Guam. Uh, I do recommend it. I know you're gonna love it. But that was the Island of Terrace here in Hilton. I hope you guys enjoyed that. You saw me stuff my face and all that stuff. I'll catch you on the next one. Thank you for watching. Like this video if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Share with your friends and family. Comment down below what you think. My name is Mark. Peace. I'm out.